Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. To replace the fan motor in your central air condensing unit, first shut off the power to the unit. You can do this by removing the fuses from the disconnect box or switching off the circuit breaker. Use a 5 16th inch socket or nut driver to unthread the lower screws securing the access cover. Loosen the upper screws and remove the cover. To ensure the run capacitor is discharged, place a screwdriver with an insulated handle across both sets of terminals. Now cut both zip ties securing the wires. Use the 5 16 inch socket to remove the mounting screws securing the fan guard. Lift up the guard and fan motor assembly and flip the assembly over. Note the orientation of the fan blade on the motor shaft, then use an adjustable wrench to loosen the set screw. Pull the fan blade off. This may require some effort. Note the orientation of the motor wires connected to the contactor and the run capacitor. Then disconnect the wires. Remove the fan motor and guard from the condensing unit. Use a 7 16 inch socket or wrench to unthread the mounting nuts securing the fan guard to the motor. Detach the old motor. Rotate the wire conduit clockwise to detach and slide the conduit off of the wires. Prepare the new fan motor for installation by sliding the conduit over the wires. Then attach it to the motor by rotating the conduit counterclockwise. Position the new motor on the fan guard and thread the nuts to secure. Return the motor and fan guard to the condensing unit and feed the wires through the two holes in the cabinet. Connect the wires to the appropriate terminals on the contactor and run capacitor. Install the fan blade by positioning it on the motor shaft with the set screw aligned with the flat side of the shaft. Tighten the set screw to secure. Flip the fan guard and motor assembly back over. Make sure the wire conduit is inserted in the hole as you align the guard. Rethread the screws to secure the guard. Use zip ties to reduce the slack in the wires. Realign the access cover. 
tighten the upper screws and re-thread the lower ones. With the repair completed, restore power to the condensing unit and your central air system should be ready for use.